The Centenarian's Return, Season 41, Trailer. Who the hell are you? Hi. Sorry about the smell. I was desperate. I'm Linda, Lizzie's adoptive mother, and I want to adopt you too, Rosie. Aw, oh, isn't Lizzie so sweet? I raised her well. I still would like to raise you, Rosie. You have always been my favorite. You met me for the first time in 22 years last night, where you were having a shit in my bathroom. Hey, lovey. Hope the funeral was okay. I thought I would cook a nice meal for us to round off the day. Right. Get out. I don't want your rotten meal. Oh. You are a one. That reminds me. I've got the adoption papers ready on the kitchen worktop. I just need you to sign. Things are really setting into motion now, eh? You know I was thinking. I am going to adopt your baby. No you're not. It's my kid. Back off and get one of your own biological kids instead of adopting others and interfering in other people's lives. Get out. I'm getting the locks changed. But I'm your mother. No you're not. Fuck right off. Don't be so cruel. You're hurting my feelings. A letter came for you today. I took the liberty to open it for you. Here you are. Creep. You're all mine now. You're part of the family now. Come and work at the surgery. We are not family. And I'm never fucking working for you. Where else would you go? No one wants you but me. What do you want to be? Homeless? Because you're not staying in my flat if you don't work? Fine I'll do it. Rosie. Why aren't you in your wedding dress? The wedding is in an hour. What's wrong honey? Yeah what's wrong Rosie? I had a miscarriage yesterday. I had it after you sent me home from work. How can I get married if I can't even tell Victor about this? I mean I haven't even told him. You haven't told him yet? That doesn't matter. I knew that you would lose the baby. Isn't that annoying? That's just so annoying. Rosie. Whatever is the matter? What's up my beautiful girl? It's tears of happiness mom. I finally feel like my old self again. You called me mom? Yeah. I want you to adopt me. I'm so sorry for the way I have been with you. You know, with the attitude and everything. You didn't deserve it. Oh you don't have to be sorry. I love you. I never thought I'd hear you say that. Come here my darling girl. Hello and welcome to the Daily News. Today's headlines are, After 20 years of being in prison, Pishopath Linda has passed away of a heart attack. Her daughter Lydia still has one more year left in prison. Let's watch the moment of when she passed away. Hello. Welcome to the Christmas special of the celebratory show. Today is a special show, because it's Kiernan's last ever TV appearance. This country has been waiting since September for the truth to be told about the dictatorship and your family history. Kiernan, don't keep us waiting any longer. Thank you. And Merry Christmas everyone. Let's not keep you waiting any longer. Here is the hidden truth, the documentary. Welcome to Information Time. Since the passing of the original Kiernan this time one year ago, Independence Today got bought out by another company. We are now in a new studio and called Information Time, as previously stated. Today marks the 100-year anniversary of Psychopath Linda's sudden death. To commemorate Linda, and the original Kiernan, who died this time last year, we are replaying Kiernan's documentary of the Linda clan from after Josh and Ellie's dictatorship. This is so unfair. The world thinks of Linda in such a bad way. Maybe I need to complete what she started. Trying to make sure that I adopt Rosie. Time to unite together some contacts. <laughs> 